Next, we will machine the 1 half inch 13 UNC thread. Thread Toolpaths gives you the option to create a screw, bolt, or nut. You can program straight threads on the outside, inside, or face of the part. You can also program multiple lead threads. From the general group, select Thread. Select the OD Thread Write tool from the tool list and enter the comment. Machine the 1 half 13 UNC thread. Select the Thread Shape Parameters tab. Under Thread Form, click Select from Table. Ensure Thread is set to Unified, UNC, UNF. Scroll through the list and select the 1 half 13 UNC thread and press OK. Lead sets the distance a nut would travel if turned once on a bolt of the given thread. Included angle determines the angle between sides of a thread measured in an axial plane. Thread angle determines the angle between one side of the thread and a line perpendicular to the thread axis. Major diameter sets the thread's largest diameter. Minor diameter sets the thread's smallest diameter. Start position determines where, on the z-axis for OD-ID threads, or on the x-axis for face slash back threads, the thread will start. End position determines where on the z-axis for OD slash ID threads, or on the x-axis for face slash back threads, the thread will end. Click on End Position. Select this midpoint here. Next, click the Start Position button and select this endpoint. The end position should be set to minus 0.596 and the start position will be set to zero. Select the Thread Cut Parameters tab. Ensure Determine Cut Depths From is set to Equal Area. Determine number of cuts is set to number of cuts, 5. Amount of last cut is set to 0. Number of spring cuts is set to 1. Acceleration clearance is set to 0.2 inches. Lead in angle is set to 29. Finish pass allowance is set to 0. Stock clearance is set to 0.1. Overcut is set to 0. And anticipated pull off is set to 0. The NC code format determines the G code that displays in the NC file depending on the toolpath you choose longhand, box, canned, or alternating. Determine cut depths determines how the material will be removed equal amounts of material at each cut or equal depths. Determine number of cuts can be set to the amount of the first cut or based on the number of cuts. If you choose the amount of the first cut, the system automatically calculates the number based on the amount of the last cut, the thread shape, and the depth of thread. Stock clearance sets how far above the top of stock the tool retracts between passes. Overcut sets how far past the end of the thread the tool moves before retracting. Anticipated pull-off sets the distance from the end of the thread that the tool begins to pull away from the thread. Acceleration clearance sets the necessary distance in the Z direction for the tool to accelerate to full speed before it starts cutting the thread. Press the OK button. Next, we will verify the operations. Select all operations and press verify. Change the view to isometric and press play.
Then, minimize the simulation window. Change the view to top and fit to screen.